Hello, check me out. Got a fancy new background, fancy new camera, cup of tea, not everything's new. The subject of today's video is sleeping bags. Sleeping bags are stupid. It's the same problem I have with urinals. They do the same thing as inventions we already have, but worse. With urinals, we already have the toilet. We don't need another half toilet coming in and taking up all the space. And if you don't agree with me on that point, ask yourself this. What do you have in your home? Hmm. The thing about sleeping bags is their USP, which stands for Unique Selling Point, not Universal Serial Bus, a valuable lesson I learned in an interview once, uh, their unique selling point is that they are a blanket as well as a mattress. But, whenever anyone sleeps in one, they put it on top of a mattress. You can get loads of different ones now. Ones that fit your body, ones, ones with hoods, the chavs of the sleeping bag world. But let's start with the first thing that annoys me about them. It's that little string at the end that pulls the whole thing together that has a plastic button on the end of it. Whenever I sleep in a sleeping bag, this, this string always dangles over my face and often hits me in the eye, which is not pleasant. And on some occasions, I have found myself breathing it in and it nearly choking me to death. So I'm sure you can understand my lack of enthusiasm for that particular part of the sleeping bag. I remember one time I was sleeping over at somebody's house, there were a lot of people sleeping over at that person's house, and there was this, this one room which was full of everyone in their sleeping bags. When I say full, I mean full. It was like sleeping bag Tetris in there. I was sleeping um, facing away from this from this one guy, he was behind me, but I didn't realise just how close behind me he was. So, as I, I, I got uncomfortable during the night, and I decided to turn around, uh, but, as I said, I didn't realise that his, his face was about here. So, so I'm uncomfortable, and I turn around. Nope. Sleeping bags are bad as well for people who toss and turn in their sleep. And I am a turner, and I am a tosser. Therefore, I always wake up in this weird, distorted position in which my head, my body, my arms and my legs have become completely independent of each other. And I have to twist and wriggle to put myself back together so that I can squirm my way out of the sleeping bag. It's a bit like in horror movies, when the zombie's hand comes punching out of the ground. That's me getting out of a sleeping bag. But by far, by far, the worst thing about sleeping bags is the temperature. It is always hot inside a sleeping bag. Doesn't matter what the temperature is outside of the sleeping bag, within it will always be boiling. You could be sleeping in Antarctica, with no tent, inside a sleeping bag, and you wouldn't be cold. Inside the sleeping bag, there could be tiny people breaking eggs and cooking them on the sleeping bag fabric. Although I'm sure that violates several health codes. So those are my thoughts about sleeping bags and why they annoy me. I shall see you in my next video, where more than likely I'll be complaining about something else.